Hi guys, good morning. Happy Monday. We are starting off a new work week in my life. Today is Monday, April 10th. I am dressed and ready because I actually am headed into the office this morning. I'm just gonna do like a half day there and then come back to my apartment during lunch, but I have to ship out a package to an influencer and all the stuff is at the office, so that's why I'm going in this morning. I'm not gonna stay the whole day because I don't think anyone else is gonna be in the office, so it's gonna be pretty quiet, so I'll probably just head back during lunch, finish out the day here. But I'm just wearing this little sweater from Princess Polly, a Goldie jeans. Just got ready super quickly. The hair is in a slick back bun because I need to wash it tonight, so super excited to be vlogging this week. It should be a very busy week, but I will check in with you guys later and yeah, hope it's a great Monday. Lennon has so kindly brought not one but two of her toys to bed with her. Sit. I'm gonna try to read a little bit before bed. I am currently trying to read It Starts With Us. I've been trying to get into this for so long now and I just am not excited to read this. I loved It Ends With Us, but I feel like I just have low expectations for the sequel and I have like no motivation to read it. But I do wanna read it though just so I can like finish out the story and see how the series ends but I'm really struggling to get into it but I'm gonna try to read some tonight but I quickly wanted to show you guys my new bedding because I got all new bedding recently as you can see it's all from Brooklinen and they are sponsoring today's video they were so kind as to send over their Lux hardcore sheet bundle which has pretty much everything you need for your bedding all in one bundle it comes with a fitted sheet a top sheet a duvet cover and then four pillowcases total i got everything in the cream color and i'm loving this like monochromatic moment but you can also mix and match the colors if you want to do like the sheets in one color and then the duvet in another if you aren't familiar with them brooklinen is a luxury sheets and home goods company they make products that are meant to elevate your home they have more than just sheets too they also have like towels robes and just so many other home essentials and all their products are just really timeless high quality pieces at a fair price i've been sleeping with these sheets for a couple of weeks now and i really just feel like my whole sleep experience has been elevated the best way to describe them is they feel like hotel sheets. They are so incredibly smooth and buttery. It's literally just the best feeling like crawling into these sheets at night. You spend a third of your life sleeping. So when it comes to picking out home essentials, your bedding and sheets should really be a top priority and quality and comfort is just so, so important. This bedding is also designed to last. My dog and my cat both sleep in bed with me. They're always right at my feet on my duvet cover. So... Having bedding that is really durable and is meant to last for a really long time is super important to me. I also feel like they get better with every wash. You can choose from their classic bundle or their luxe bundle, which is what I have. And the luxe bundle is just really meant to feel super luxurious. Like I said, hotel quality. Plus you automatically save 25% off when you buy their bundles versus buying the items individually. If you guys wanna check out Brooklinen, you can shop their luxe bundle or their classic bundle right from the comfort of your own home on their website. They have over 20 colors and patterns to choose from. I had such a hard time deciding what color to get Get my bedding in very happy with my choice of the cream but all of their colors are just like the perfect neutral but like cozy timeless colors they did hook it up with a discount code so you guys can use the code maddie said like to get 20 dollars off your order of 100 dollars or more if you guys are on the market for new bedding or really any home essentials i cannot recommend brooklinen enough definitely check it out and thanks again to brooklinen for sponsoring today's video
Tuesday. I just made a little lunch. I made this pasta salad. So I just cooked some pasta, added in tomato, mozzarella, avocado, and then drizzled everything with a juice from half a lemon and then added salt and pepper. The lemon is key because that's the only thing that like gives it any flavor, but it's really good. I've been making this for lunch recently. Pasta salad isn't like the healthiest option, but I feel like it's filling and this is like a very light version of a pasta, so it's good enough. I'm just taking a quick little lunch break right now before I have back-to-back -back calls this afternoon. Yesterday was so busy. I had so much to get done, but today is like a little more normal, so I'm finally catching up on some to-dos that have just been like pushed to the back burner for me. So getting things done, having a productive day. mood today because it is supposed to hit 80 degrees it's supposed to be over 80 today tomorrow and friday which is unreal 80 and sunny it's only 11 right now and it's already over 70 so it's just going to be a great day i am going to try to spend as much time as possible outside today i'm about to take a little break to take lennon on a walk gonna go for a nice long walk and then later this afternoon i'll probably take my laptop over to the dog park and just sit outside and work from there for a little bit. I can use my hotspot on my phone to get connection over there. It's not like the best Wi-Fi, but after 2.30 today, I have no calls on my calendar, so I can work with a little spotty connection for a little bit if it means I can be outside in this beautiful weather. So very excited about that. Gonna head out for a walk now. Today's work from home outfit is a little set active set, leggings and sports bra, and then a little matching t-shirt and the fact that i don't have to wear a jacket or sweatshirt at all i'm so happy It's Wednesday night, which means it's Vanderpump Rules night. If you are watching the season, feel free to chit chat in the comments about it. I am so obsessed with this season. I find myself just like waiting for the next episode to come out. I'm counting down the days until the reunion. I'm an OG Vanderpump Rules fan. I watched since season one, but then I stopped. I think it was around like season seven. Whenever they introduced all the like new younger characters into the cast, I just lost interest and kind of stopped watching for a few seasons but then obviously when scandal news broke i started watching this season and i am back fully invested good morning guys i cannot believe i'm wearing a tank top right now but it is already 70 degrees and it's like 8 30 in the morning and it's supposed to be in the 80s again today i am once again gonna try to work outside for a lot of the afternoon but i just went and grabbed a coffee i went to hidden grounds coffee which they have locations in jersey city hoboken and i think in manhattan too and it's my current obsession this is the new orleans cold brew and it's literally one of the best coffees i've ever had it's so good I am obsessed with it and I've been craving it. So I just went and got that. And then I'm also going to run to the grocery store this morning. I only need like a couple things, but I just want to get some groceries to get me through the rest of this week. Just need some like fresh produce things. So I'm going to do that this morning before work. It's Thursday, so it's the last day of the work week for me. 
I'm back from Trader Joe's. I just picked up a few things. Very small grocery haul. Starting with two overnight oats. I like the almond butter ones better than the vanilla. I feel like that's controversial. I feel like the vanilla ones are more popular, but I really like these. I also just got this turkey apple cheddar sandwich for lunch today. I got two little wellness shot, one ginger and one turmeric. Vanilla yogurt, blueberries and blackberries. Lastly, just got some apples. Oh, and then I also got some flowers to brighten up my apartment a little bit this week. rushing out the door running late as I always am but I'm done with work for the day and I'm headed to the city for a quick event with dry bar hence why my hair is not done because I'm actually getting a blowout there which is just very much needed I timed my hair wash schedule this week around this event so I'm super excited they're launching a new product that's like a frizz control spray so very intrigued and excited to get a blowout. I love dry bar. Just threw on this very quick outfit. I've worn this top so many times, I feel like in recent videos, but it's from Revolve. I love it. It's like the perfect little spring top. And then my jeans, I'm trying to show you the bottom. They're actually flare jeans. I got these last weekend at Madewell and I'm obsessed with them. I feel like they're giving very like 70s daisy jones vibes they're just more flattering because like they're tight at the top and they like hug your hips and stuff but then the flare just gives like something different and then i'm wearing my little like cowboy boots with them and i just feel like they look really good with a pointed toe little heeled shoe anyway that's the fit i will vlog at the event This hair is giving, it's giving volume, it's giving bounce. Also, my hair smells so good right now. Dry bar, like, scents are just premium. I wanted to end off this vlog because it's Thursday night. It is like 10 o'clock and I'm going to take my makeup off, put on sweats, and go to sleep. And then I think I'm going to start up a new vlog for the weekend. So I'm going to end this one off here. I hope you enjoyed watching this little week in my life. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also follow me on Instagram to keep up with more of my day-to-day -day life over there. Love you guys so much and I'll talk to you in my next video very soon. Bye!